friends, Queen of Flannel here. Welcome back to the channel. I'm very excited about what I have for us today. Uh, I know it's been a lot of flip throughs. I mentioned this in the uh, last one. Um, one, I've had new books that I've been excited to share and a couple of them were requests and due to, you know, some personal things going on, in my life, uh, it's been a little difficult to record a, a lot of art projects, um, but I do have some art in the works that I should be able to get to you guys on Saturday. But anyways, we have the brand new Mythographic Color and Discover Wild Summer by Joseph Cadambang. Uh He is probably my favorite mythographic artist. So when I saw that he had another book coming out, I pre-ordered it. I was really excited about it. I have not looked in this book. Uh, I have not watched any other flip throughs. So you guys will get to see my genuine reaction. I know that he posted a full flip through. Haven't watched it. So we're going to take a look at it together today. I do talk through my flip throughs, provide, you know, some commentary if I have thoughts on things I might like to do with certain pages, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. So if that's not for you, uh, you can, you know, pause the, uh, the audio, lower the volume and just watch the flip through. But yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, and get into this. Make sure first off that I am in frame here. So... We've got our title page, same thick, nice cardstock. Now, I will say right off the bat that this paper looks a fair bit more uh, white than some of the other mythographic books. I don't have one handy to, to pull to look at, but I feel like the past couple the paper has been a little bit more towards the the ivory side just like right off the bat it just looks brighter to me so but it feels the same uh thickness as the other mythographic books and as always they are single-sided and you've got the perforations here if you want to take the page out of the book and if you want to use alcohol markers, you have that option, but I would put another piece of paper between them um, because it is going to bleed through. But Oh, this is, this is cute. I think this is the, one of the ones that um, was one of the preview images. I should, clarify that. I haven't looked at a full flip through, but I did when I pre-ordered uh, look at, you know, the couple images that they had as like preview images. So that's all I've seen of this book. And I believe this was, um, this was one of them. So God, that's adorable. I think what I like about his work is that it's detailed, but it's not so compact that you can't separate, uh, various like items from other items so I feel like it makes them a little bit more uh, manageable to to color and his art style has really come a long way from the uh, the earlier mythographic books oh I like this one too Oh, this would be good for, I've been looking for uh, summer-ish themed images for uh, later on in the summer. So this would be, this one would be fun to do.
Oh, that's that's cool. It took me a minute, but we've got a, a rock elephant back here. Gosh, these images are gorgeous. Oh, that is so cute. Sorry, I'm trying not to like flip through these too fast. I just, I'm just like, normally I, I have commentary like one way or the other, either about something that, um, <laughs> random planets, uh, something that, you know, I'm not a, as fond of, but I'm kind of just sitting here like trying to come up with ideas in my, in my head about what I want to, uh to do in this book because so far I I have not come across uh, an image that I that I wouldn't that I wouldn't color and that's not that's that's not a common occurrence even with authors that I, I really like sometimes there's just images that I I just I have no vision for no desire to to color but so far with with this book, I could see myself doing just about every every image that we've we have looked at so far. another bunny page although the the last one was technically jackalopes but
this is interesting. The uh, the face down here. Okay, see, these planets and the sun make sense in the context of the whole scope of the of the image. Now, granted, they are in the ocean, but we've got an astronaut here. It's cohesive. Oh, that's cool and different he tends to uh to to stick to a really excuse me i got the hiccups um consistent like line weight throughout the majority of of his work so seeing the uh the thicker uh inking on this is is neat to see Oh, that is so cute. I think these are supposed to be sun um sun rays. Oh, I like this. And the tree is coming up out of his, like where his horn would be. Oh my gosh. I love it. Oh boy, we know how Queen feels about uh, paper lanterns. This would be uh, fun to do for uh, for August. I know it's not specifically like zodiac, but with the uh, the lion in it and 
yeah, this would be this this might be something that um that I do later on in the uh the summer. Are these somebody somebody will tell me in the comments these look like axolotls is, is that what these these are Oh, they're on giant ice cubes. I love potion. Makes me want to go read Charlotte's Web. I think I would do, I would do the majority. So I, obviously, I would color the the pig like pink, and I think I would do all of the like the balloons in either a contrasting color in a darker pink. Oh, I have ideas for this this one. And that's our that's our last image. So let me go ahead and uh, get this back to the cover here. So uh, that is our flip through Mythographic Color and Discover Wild Summer by Joseph Katamang. I am very excited to work in this this book. Um, there is not an image in here that I that I can't see myself at some point, uh, working on. And I already have some I ideas for a few of, of these, especially for, um, later on this summer, I am working on trying to put together some, uh, some videos for when I will be away for, uh, for work. But I love this book. Um, I, 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 I don't really, I don't really have like words, I guess. Um, I have nothing bad to say ab about this, this book. Um, very, very excited to work in this. So I will link to, uh, Amazon down below where I purchased my copy. If you're interested in, uh, and picking this up, let me know in the comments what you think, if you pre-ordered it, if, uh, you now that you've seen a flip through of it, if you're going to, uh, yeah, let me know what you what you guys think. So, thanks so much for taking the time to watch the video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please consider a like, a sub, a comment, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much.